Hey y'all, let me apologize in advance if you hear any breathing, heavy breathing, or shuffling around or anything weird in this video. My 11 year old bulldog is in the room with me today and he's a big boy, so he makes a lot of noise. Um, he didn't want to be alone, so yeah, he's going to be hanging out with me. But today I'm watching T2 Judgment Day. I really enjoyed the first one a lot more than I thought I was going to, and everyone has been telling me that the second one's even better, so I'm excited to get into it. If you guys would like early access to my full reaction, my Patreon link will be down in the description below, and if you enjoy this reaction, please remember to like, subscribe, and ring the bell, and let's get into Terminator 2 Judgment Day. Oh lord, is this still the future? Is that the same playground? Three billion human lives ended on August 29th, 1997. The survivors of the nuclear fire, they lived only to face a new nightmare. The war against the machines. Oh lord have mercy. As if surviving the first time wasn't bad enough. I mean, it would be nearly impossible to fight these things. They're huge. Damn. Well, he got crushed. The computer which controlled the machines sent two Terminators back through time to destroy the leader of the human resistance. So there's two coming now. Great. The first Terminator was programmed to strike at me in the year 1984. The second was set to strike at John himself when he was still a child. Oh, okay. So not two at the same time then. The resistance was able to send a lone warrior, a protector for John. It was just a question of which one of them would reach him first. That's a creepy image. Those things really do look terrifying, though. Damn. Do people not throw away their trash? Here we go. Is this Arnie? No. Yes? Yes, it is. Okay. Is he gonna kill another person and take their clothes? Uh. Can you imagine seeing that? Just some naked guy walking into the bar. <laughs> Oh, she liked it. <laughs> oh god, are he, he might want your leather pants. Fit probability. Oh, okay. Your clothes, your boots, and your motorcycle. <laughs> uh, I don't think you should laugh at him. You look at this man, and you really think you can take him? Oh. <laughs> Just signed your death warrant. Jesus, yep. Oh, ow. Oh, oh, just roll off of it. Pull it out. Pull it out. Yeah, smart. Leave it alone. Uh huh. Now you're close. Oh my gosh. Can't let you take the man's wheel, son. Really, dude? Oh god. Why why would you even bother? It's not worth your life. Was it it wasn't worth your life. Uh, I'm surprised no one got killed. 
Well, he didn't need the glasses for a messed up eye this time. I guess he just liked the the look. Wait, so there are gonna be two of them this time, or two? Is it gonna be two machines? Or is it gonna be like last time where there was like a human and a machine coming for drawing? One to help and one to try and kill him. Because that looks. Okay. I bet his butthole spread open. <laughs> Bending down like that. <laughs> oh, damn. John been getting in trouble? John? John, get in there and clean up that pig sky I like that car. Foster parents are kind of dicks, huh? Foster parents? What happened to Sarah? Boy with his ginger mullet flapping in the wind. This next patient is interesting. I've been following the case for years. Oh my god, did they think she was crazy? Damn, girl is ripped. She believes that a machine called a Terminator was sent back through time to kill her. And also that the father of her child was a soldier sent back to protect her. Now, why would she tell people this? She couldn't have really thought people would believe her. Good morning, Dr. Silverman. <laughs> she looked wild. She uh, stabbed me in the kneecap with... My pen a few weeks ago. Uh, damn, Sarah, you've changed. Douglas, I don't like to see the patients disrupting their rooms like this. See that she takes her thorns in, would you? Sure, Dr. Silverman, I'll take care of it. She's just working out. Damn, leave her alone. Is this the guy that was sent to protect, or? Are you the legal guardian of John Connor? That's right, officer. What's he done now? Do you have a photograph of John? Yeah, sure. Hold on. You gonna tell me what this is about? Yeah, I was about to say I'd want to know why first. There was a guy here this morning looking for him too. Yeah, a big guy on a bike. Does that got something to do with this? Uh, that would be Arnie. No. I wouldn't worry about him. Use a damn lie. Thanks for your cooperation. Um, you gonna tell me a big guy on a bike comes looking for my son not to worry about it? No, I think I'd be worried about it. stuff from anyway from my mom my real mom i mean so sarah's learned a few things over these years she's pretty cool huh no she's a complete psycho she tried to blow up the computer factory but she got shot and arrested oh shit she ain't a psycho god No, she wasn't this ripped in the first one, was she? Like, she got in shape for this role, because I don't remember her arms looking that good. Children look like burnt paper. Oof. Black. Mmm. And then the blast wave hits them. God. Yeah, I would not want to dream about that every night. I'm sure it feels very real to you. On August 29th, 1997, it's gonna feel pretty fucking real to you, too! She is killing the acting in this one. Oh, you're dead already! This whole place, everything you see is gone! You're the one living in a fucking dream, so with it! Cause I know it happens! It happens! Oof, I just got cold chills from her acting. I feel much better now. <laughs> Your attitude has been much improved lately. Yeah, I would be saying and doing whatever I they wanted me to to get back to my son you said that if i showed improvement after six months i could have visitors i was looking forward to seeing my son 
You better not. But you've told me on many occasions about how you crushed one in a hydraulic press. Well, if I had, there would have been some evidence. So you don't believe anymore that the company covered it up? I was about to say, well, who covered that up? Because there had to have been remnants. Well, if you know where it came from. You know, I asked them that very same question once, and you know what they told me? Don't ask. Where it came from? with it? What is that? Is that a piece of, uh, the Terminator from the last movie? Well, there's an arm. Here's the problem. I know how smart you are. And I think you're just telling me what I want to hear. I don't think you really believe what you're telling me today. Now how is she supposed to prove to you that she believes it or not? Please. Please. I think she's about to kill you. <laughs> I don't see any choice but to recommend to the review board that you stay here for another six months. Oh, I would rip your damn head off. <laughs> That's what I figured. Leave her alone, damn it. Model citizen. Shut up. Oh lord, he found him. Oh god. Well shit. <laughs> He's just causing accidents now. I just missed him. He was here like 15 minutes ago. I think he said he was going to the Galleria, right? The Galleria? Lord. And he doesn't know he's in danger. He's just enjoying his day, stealing money and going to the arcade. Oh my god, does he have a gun hiding in a box of roses? Hey, do you know this guy? Don't you say anything. Nah, I don't know. Thank you. John, not now, not now. Hey, man, there's this cop scoping for you. Check it out. I wouldn't want to check out if a cop was looking for me. <laughs> I'd be like, no, man, I don't want them to see me. Let's go. Damn, dude. Oh, Lord. Ernie's gonna find you. So is the cop dude trying to help him? Oh, my God. Dude, run! I'd be shitting myself. Get down! Get down! Oh! What? So Arnie was the one sent back to protect him? Well, hell yeah. See, now, I would feel much safer with a Terminator on my side. Did his metal just fix itself? Damn. <laughs> they are fucking this mall up. Yeah, I would be- oh my god, I would pee myself. I would pee myself. Oh lord, oh lord, oh lord. Is that the- I don't know if that thing can be fast enough. <laughs> Damn, he is fast. What the hell? Oh, I didn't even s <laughs> I didn't even see him. I thought the dude just jumped out of his truck. <laughs> Did the human somehow find a way to make the Terminators, like, on their side? Like, I don't... And why does he still look like Arnie? Oh, sh shit. Now, surely that thing ain't gonna still work. This is like a GTA chase. You 
got to find a small space that he can't fit the truck through. Now how is he cocking his gun like that? I ain't never seen something like that. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Oh shit. Of course he ducked. Ooh. Well, that was close. <laughs> Just picked him up one handed. Did he duck? Okay. Holy shit. Now, if I hadn't seen the first movie, I would assume that, you know, he'd be dead, but I know he's not. Especially after I just saw him heal himself. I don't- that wasn't a thing last time, was it? Yeah. Oh. He's different. Why does this one look like a silver surfer? Now don't take this the wrong way, but you are a Terminator, right? Yes. Sabaton Systems Model 101. No. Did he think his mom was crazy too? Poking him. I'm just glad he's on our side this time. My mission is to protect you. Yeah? Who sent you? 35 years from now, you reprogrammed me to be your protector here. In this time. Okay, see. Hello? Janelle, it's me. Is everything alright? Are you guys okay? Sure, honey. Everything's okay. Honey, I was beginning to worry about you. Something's wrong. She's never this nice. I was about to say, they don't seem like dicks to me. thought you were going to tell the kid to get rid of that fucking mutt. <gasps> John, honey, it's late. Please don't make me worry. What the hell's that? What's the dog's name? Max. Hey, Janelle. What's wrong with Wolfie? Wolfie's fine, honey. Wolfie's just fine. Mm-mm. What? If first the parents are dead. Oh my god. What is this now? Her arm's a sword. Is this the- So he can look like anybody he wants? You're telling me that this thing can imitate anything it touches? Anything it samples by physical contact. Oh lord, have mercy. Like, like they weren't scary enough to begin with. These were taken at a mall in Reseda. Today. She knows her son is in danger. We know this guy's involved. Doesn't that mean anything to you? Don't you care? She cares. She's trying to figure out how she's going to get the hell out of here. If there's anything, then I'll call you. Sure. Douglas, take her back to her room, please. For a while there, she was with this crazy ex Green Beret guy. Running guns. What kind of stuff she be getting into? She'd shack up with anybody she can learn from so she could teach me how to be this great military leader. Oh, I see. But everything she said was true. And nobody believed her. Well, it is hard to believe, <laughs> to be fair to everyone. As probability for success now will be to copy Sarah Connor and to wait for you to make contact with her. Typically, the subject being copied is terminated. Shit, why did you tell me? We gotta go right now! <laughs> Negative. It's not a mission priority. You think he would have programmed him to protect his mother, too? Help me! Get up! Get the thing off of me! Let me go! So does he have to Wait, do what he says? Do that? Because you told me to. So he has to do what he says. Because he is John Connor. You okay, kid? Take a hike, Bozo. So let's get out of here. What? <laughs> Fuck you, you little dipshit! Dipshit? Well, you are being kind of rude, John. Grab this guy. I can't believe he called me. Ah, ah, oh, Lord. Oh, my God. Get him off of me. And now, who's the dipshit and jock douchebag? Get off of me. John, you got... Oh, my God. See, he didn't, he didn't deserve to get his wrist broken. No, no, no. No, 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 no. <laughs> no. Get out of here. What did you think was going to happen? <laughs> Jesus, you're going to kill that guy. Of course, I'm a Terminator. Uh, you just can't go around killing people. Why? 
What do you mean, why? Because you can't! He's a machine, he doesn't understand. Oh, is he visiting Sarah Connor? Ew, why are you being creepy? Mm-mm. Oh, I know you are not. And please, oh, please stop it. What the fuck? Oh. Hmm. I hope you fucking die. A slow death. Ugh. You should have bit his face. I would never be able to do that. He about to kill everybody up in this place. Alright, come on girl. You've got to go. Oh my god. They can turn into the damn floor? I mean... How are you supposed to defeat? I mean, I thought the first one was bad. The first Terminator, but this is just ridiculous. Hey, I got a full house. That's good, Lewis. Must be bad lucky day. Oh, no. I don't think it is. He really likes his sword hands. Please kill this man. I mean, I should have known this guy was a creep just based off of his glasses. Oh, it hardly gets to- Oh, hell yeah! <laughs> yes, beat his nasty ass. I love it. Uh <laughs> she tried to preoccupy his hands to distract him for a second. Broke my arm. There are 215 bones in the human body. That's one. Now don't move. What is she doing? Um. What the hell are you doing? You son of a bitch! You didn't say you couldn't harm someone. He'll live. <laughs> what, will he ever walk again now that you've blown out his kneecaps? Let's all try to remain calm. Open it or he'll be dead before he hits the floor. Damn, she got the needle all the way in his neck. Get back! I'll pop him full of this shit, I swear! He ain't messing around, dude. Um, yeah, I was about to say, come on, little dude, you can't. <laughs> If y'all get in his way, you are very much gonna regret it. Oh no. Oh, it's him. She's not gonna know. <laughs> yeah, I would be terrified if I were. John, say something. No! 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 I'm feeling Arnie's gonna. Fuck him up. No, no, he's on our side this time. Uh. He's gonna accidentally kill someone. Come with me if you want to live. It's okay, mom. He's here to help. I said it again. Yep, that's the one. And of course, he can just melt through shit. It doesn't even slow him down. Oh my god! This would be so annoying! <laughs> Get down! Good god. Yeah, I'd be laying flat on the ground. <laughs> Shit! Yes! Get down! Get 
Now's not the time, dude. Just out of the car. Shit! Right now! The girl ain't afraid to shoot at somebody. <laughs> You just plopping down like a damn turd log. So I would seem like crushing this one is out of the question since he can just like melt himself. So how the hell do you kill this? Come on. Here. I'm assuming Sarah taught him about guns. It's making like liquidy noises when it hits. Oh god. He's fast as hell too. Oh my god. <laughs> His metal arms are just clanking. <laughs> I wouldn't want a piece of him left behind either. Can you even see anything? I see everything. <laughs> yeah. It's gotta be weird seeing the face of the man who killed the man who killed the person you fell in love with and tried to kill you. I'm sorry. I didn't need your help. I can take care of myself. Well, you're his mother, and he loves you, so he doesn't care whether you can take care of yourself. What's wrong with your eyes? Oh. Yeah, and that's a good idea. You know what you're doing? I have detailed files on human anatomy. I bet. <laughs> you a more efficient killer, right? Correct. She's not loving this. The more contact I have with humans, the more I learn. Cool. Oh. But can you... I mean, you can learn emotions, but I don't think you can actually become more human. Good God. I didn't even bother checking for keys before he just started ripping that car apart. No, 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 no. You say, no problemo. <laughs> and if someone comes off to you with an attitude, you say, eat me. Why are we trying to make the Terminator more cool? And if someone gets upset, you say, chill out. Or you could do combinations. Chill out. Dick what? <laughs> That's great. See, you're getting it. Oh, my goodness. Want some of my fries? Sarah, hug your child. Those guns look very real. We're not gonna make it, are we? People, I mean. It's in your nature to destroy yourselves. Ain't that the truth? I need to know how Skynet gets built. Who's responsible? The main most directly responsible is Miles Bennett Dyson. The guy with the arm? Why him? In a few months, he creates a revolutionary type of microprocessor. All stealth bombers are upgraded with Cyberdyne computers Wait, fully unmanned. Him going back in time in the first movie cause this um, equipment to become a thing? Ugh. I have a snake phobia. That just <laughs> shivers down my damn legs. <laughs> Qué bueno verte, Connor. Dije que iba a regresar. Y yo lo sabía, carajo. Okay, can you hug your son like that? Because I've not seen her show him any affection so far, unless I missed it. Drink. Can they drink? Uncle Bob? Well, that fire, their, or fry their system. Oh, God, what are you doing to the baby? Oh, God, what are you doing to the baby? <laughs> Is he just studying the baby? <laughs> Damn! They got a whole ass bunker under there. See, I grew up in places like this. 
So I just thought that's how people live. That is quite the weapon there. That's definitely you. <laughs> she looks so cool in this movie. She is in such good shape. Wish I could have met my real dad. You will. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> you will. Five, I think. Oh, he knows when he'll meet. Okay. Yeah, that is insane. She still loves him, I guess. I see her crying sometimes. She's had it rough, man. Why do you cry? You mean people? Yeah. I don't know. We just cry. You know, when it hurts. Or when you're very mad. Or very happy. <laughs> All right, my man! No problemo. Give me five! <laughs> I was about to say, how hard is he gonna slap him? His just knocks his hand off his wrist. Five low. <laughs> Too slow. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> he looked offended. The Terminator would never stop. It would never leave him. And it would never hurt him. And it would die to protect him. Oh, well, he programmed it to. In an insane world. It was the sanest choice. I mean, the only thing that could screw it up is if somebody else got a hold of him and re-reprogrammed him to want to kill him. <laughs> oh gosh. Is this her dream or is this just the scene from the beginning of the movie? This must be her horrible, awful dream. Okay. I don't want to see a bunch of kids get burnt. Oh my god. Oh my god. If I'm gonna go in a blast like that, like, I, I would like to go quickly, please, not slowly burn. It reminded me of the, the Pompeii bodies. It's a hell of a nightmare. She'll meet you tomorrow. Mom! Man, I feel so bad for John. The whole thing goes. The future's not set. There's no fit but what we make for ourselves. Yeah. Tends to change the future. Is she gonna try and kill Dyson? Shit. Dyson. Yeah. Gotta be. I thought, yeah. When she was asking all about all the details of him. But even if you killed him, you gotta figure out what he's using to make that technology because if not, somebody else would probably just discover it and do the same thing or something similar. Killing Dyson might actually prevent the war. I don't care! Haven't you figured out why you can't kill people? I don't know. One life versus billions. I may talk to him first and be like, look, you're gonna create something that's gonna kill everybody. And then if he refused to stop what he was doing, I don't know, it would probably be worth it to kill one to save billions. I would probably try talking to the man first, because he, he might not just, he might not be an evil genius or anything, he just whoopsie daisied it. Okay, or not. Girl, be careful, there's a kid in there. Girl, be careful. Yeah, I be like, what the hell is going on? Why are we getting shot at? She's acting like a damn Terminator herself. 
Oh, she does not care. She does not care about the son, the wife. Well, this is actually really sad. Like, oh, don't, please. Okay, don't, don't make, don't, don't make those faces. It's making me sad. See, this is what I said. I would, I would talk to him first. Yeah, girl, chill. You, you should probably explain yourself. Who can blame you, though, girl? This is a hard, hard situation to be in. <laughs> I love you, John. Thank you. Finally. I know. It's about Tom. Oh. Yeah, that would be <laughs> unsettling. <laughs> Can you imagine not knowing that this was a machine and seeing somebody just start to rip their skin off? <laughs> Give them one of these. It's not every day that you find out you're responsible for three billion deaths. Yeah, if you're not evil, that would be something. Or that would be pretty hard to deal with. He still doesn't trust him. There's no way I'm going to finish the new processor. Not now. Forget it. I'm out of it. I'll quit Cyberdyne tomorrow. No one must follow your work. Yeah. I'm, see, that's what I was talking about. It, somebody could pick up right after him. The chip. Do you know about the chip? What chip? It must be from the other one, like you. The CPU from the first Terminator. Son of a bitch! I knew it. And they locked her up over some bullshit. Must be destroyed. Can you get us in? Pass security. I think so. Yeah. When? As soon as possible. Mr. Dyson, now you know the rules concerning visitors in the lab. I need real. <coughs> I insist. <laughs> yeah, they weren't asking. My card should access this thing. The silent alarm's been tripped. Y'all didn't think about there being more than one security guard? I think it's that guy from the mall. It's the guy. Yeah, it's him and the woman. Look, just send everything you got in the area right now. Oh, Lord. The other Terminator's probably gonna catch wind of this, too. It's no good. Let me try mine. Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you've already tripped the alarm. What does it matter? So wait a few minutes until the gas clears. Put this on. They got gas? 144 Kramer Street, the Cyberdyne building. The thick one is white female, identified as last name Connor, first name Sarah. See, of course, of course he was going to hear it over the radio. If y'all could just mind your business for a little while longer. Alright, seven, two, five, six. Yes! John, getting it. You got company. Police? How many? Of course. Oh. You about to have Terminator company, too. I'll take you off the police. Hey, wait, you swore! Trust me. So I'm just gonna blow out their kneecaps. It's fine. <laughs> He's not programmed to do that. Is he just destroying their cars?
This gun is insane. <laughs> Well, he hasn't kneecapped anybody. Well, he swore. We go, same time to the left. One, two, three, go. Is it gonna be gone? Okay. Good. Um that's going up by the balls now, don't we? Come on. Let's book. I thought those were going to be gone. Somebody else took them and did the evil deed. Time to go. Now. Take this. They'll use gas. Giles, hand me the detonator. Oh, why is everything in slow motion? What's about to happen? Oh! So, oh, are you fucking serious? This poor man. This poor man was just trying to help. Good God. Shit, she's in the clean room. There's no way out of there. Uh, well, he'll just make away like the Kool Aid man. I don't know how much longer I can hold this. Yeah, can y'all, like, go away? I feel bad for this man's wife and son. Here he comes to wreck the day. Tear gas. Stay here. I'll be back. <laughs> he said it again. <laughs> Get down on the floor and face down. Down on the floor now. Unless y'all can press him, it ain't gonna matter. Lord, they're tearing him to pieces, though. <laughs> there he goes, kneecapping people. <laughs> I mean, really, just a rot in the legs every time. <laughs> oh, oh, oh! Ow! That would hurt. Yeah, <laughs> oh, he really just got to steal their mask and run off their faces. <laughs> oh, Lord. He really loves driving vehicles through buildings. No! Now y'all need to get away and ditch this car as soon as you can. Termina uh, Terminators can't be bothered. When they're driving, they they just drive through buildings instead of around them or whatever. Get out. Um. We are. Ah! He really said okay. Stay under these vests. You got it. Yeah. Right. Are those bulletproof vests she's putting like in the window. Girl, watch out! As if the semi wasn't bad enough last time, now the Terminator's got to be in a damn helicopter coming after you. Damn, dude! Stay down. Yeah, as I was saying, she told you I stay under them damn vests. Ah! Oh shit! Oh damn! Well, that'll help. <laughs> well, that won't. Shit. Oh, damn. You are right, I'm 
Was that necessary? I mean, he wasn't in your way. Are you hurt? Obviously. Here we go, and there comes the semi truck again. Wow! <laughs> He's gaining. Fast too. This is the vehicle's top speed. I can get out of road faster than this. Hey, look at the vehicle y'all stole. Of course, it's not gonna go that fast. Watch your fucking. Woo! Wait. Mm-hmm. Y'all are gonna be mushed in that damn car. Let Sarah teach him how to drive, too. Hold on. Now, how is he driving this well in this stressful situation? I probably couldn't do that. I mean, y'all are just connected at this point. His liquidy ass just goes right back together. Yeah, you uh, you better get out of the way. Oh shit! That could have decapitated somebody. That is liquid nitrogen. Get the hell out of here! Mm-hmm. Too stubborn to die. Is this gonna do anything to him? Slowing him down. Mm, there goes a foot. Oh, oh! We're breaking like a porcelain doll. Hasta la vista, baby. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, now he's shattered. It's funny because the, the last Terminator got blew up with a. I don't know if it's propane or what, but the truck exploded in a fire, and this one truck froze him. Is it gonna, like, if he, if the stuff melts, if he gets warm again, is he just gonna reassemble himself? We don't have much time. The truck explosion last time didn't kill him, so I don't know why I thought this would be the end. We know freezing him will at least stop him, but what else can you do against this man? How do you keep him frozen? This way. <sighs> this way. I don't know how the hell they they could even possibly start to outrun this man. He is fast as hell, and she doesn't have a leg. <laughs> go, run! No, we gotta stick together. John, you got to go now. John, go now! No! John's attached to him. <laughs> Shit! And how is he gonna win against this newer model? <laughs> I mean, he's kicking his ass, but this guy, like, he is hard to kill. Look at it. Look at it. He just eats his fist with his body. Oh, shit. Shit. Barney, you better rip your arm off there, bud. He did. He just ripped it right off. Mom, come on! Girl! Mom! What are you doing? Girl, what are you doing? Mm -hmm. 
That ain't enough, girl. Shit. Damn it. Aren't you gonna get to her? No! Somebody help her! Call to John. She ain't gonna do that, you bitch. Uh -uh -uh. I don't know why I'm leaning back like he's about to stab me. <laughs> Call to John now. Call these nuts. Thank God. He's like fucking flubber. How are you supposed to kill that? Now he's getting his ass beat. Oh lord, not again. Not we no okay. Oh, I don't like it. Now I like this little I like this little terminator now. <laughs> don't want him to die. <laughs> Oh god. No. Are you serious? Oh, oh, he's glowing. He's glowing. He's got some life still. Oh, now you've got them glowing eyes. You done messed up now. <laughs> A lot of dank out of there. Uh-uh. That ain't your mom. She would never yell out like that, giving away the fact that she's hurt and giving y'all's position away. That ain't her. Get out of the way, John. Shoot! Mm-hmm. That's what I thought. Ain't no way she's giving up where she is and calling John to her. She cocks a gun like a badass, too. Mm -hmm. Get his ass. Get his ass. Get it. You big ass muscles. Oh, shit. Just go drop kick him. This is Sparta right in his chest. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Here he comes. <laughs> Damn. Really blasted his ass apart. Lord. That looks painful. Sounds like a damn dying dinosaur. Are these all the people he's turned into? Looks like a damn demon. Holy shit. Yeah, he's... <laughs> You're a Terminator! What do you mean? Where do Terminators go on vacation? Will this mountain there? Yes. Throw it in. Don't worry about the chip. Adios. And the chip. Mm-hmm. What I said. It's over. No. What? What do you mean no? There's one more chip. It must be destroyed also. What do you mean? I cannot self-terminate. You must lower me into the steel. Well, that's... That fucking sucks. I'm no! sorry, John. I'm sorry. No, it'll be okay. Stay with us. It'll be okay. Aww. No, wait. Wait, you don't have to do this. Sorry. Aww. No, don't do it. Don't go. 
He said sorry. <laughs> I order you not to go! I order you not to go! Oh, part one! I know now why you cry. But it's something I can never do. That's sad. I need to give him a hug. Why did that make me tear up? He's not a person. <laughs> This makes me so sad for John. <laughs> Poor John. It's had it rough. See, he went in all cool like the other guy went in screaming like a bitch. <laughs> he gave him a thumbs up. <laughs> I'm sad. He wasn't a person. I face it for the first time with a sense of hope. Because if a machine can learn the value of human life, maybe we can too. Let's hope so. I gotta say, I can see why you guys really like this one. And I love it too, but it made me really sad at the end. I <laughs> don't know why I'm so sad. Or, you know, a machine, but I am. It was sad. I feel sad for John. But I have to say, I'm obsessed with Sarah in this one. The fact that she's been training like she has, and she got into shape for this role, okay? Her arms look amazing. I need to know what her exercise routine was. She was a straight badass. And her acting this movie was so good. It's the scene... Where she's screaming in the psychiatric unit gave me goosebumps, like literally, because she was just so good in it. I wasn't expecting Arnie to be good in this. <laughs> I, it, I, I thought the other guy was coming to help and Arnie was the bad guy again. I can't imagine how Sarah must have felt when she saw his face again. Yeah, I would freak out too. Because, um, yeah, last time he was around, he was up to no good. So, how would you feel? The new Terminator in this was absolutely insane. I thought the first Terminator was hard to kill, but this guy, Jesus Christ. I mean, he could just melt and then put himself back together again. Could melt himself through bars. Yeah, not somebody or something that I would ever want to deal with because you would have to be in the right place at the right time just to be able to kill him. And um, yeah, no thank you. I know there's more movies after this, but personally, I want to believe that this is where the story ends and that they save the day and that um, nobody else was killed. That's what I'm choosing to believe. Unless, of course, a bunch of people ask me to watch the next one and then uh, I don't know, we'll see. <laughs> For right now, I'm choosing to believe that this is where the story ends and everybody lives happily ever after and John gets to live a normal life, which probably is not the case, but I, that's what I'm telling myself. <laughs> I really enjoy, really, really enjoyed this and just let me know what you guys think about this movie down in the comments below and I'll see you in the next one.